I'm just going to start with a little walk or a little bit of a jog if that's what you want to do. And just, just get ourselves going. All right. Pump the arms. Put a smile on. It's a beautiful day this morning. We're going to take our feet a little wider. So today we're going to work all lower body, all upper body, core. And though I consider the back part of the core, I have some separate back exercises for us. Four more. Four, three, two. Feet wide, take a little bit of a squat down or a hip hinge, weight back to the heels. So we have three sets today. The longest set is the first. And then we move on from there. Give me eight more, turn the toes out a little bit more. Drop the hips open, sit the weight back. Give me four more times like that. Four, three, two. We're gonna peek our feet out wide, lunge side to side with a shoulder roll, back and round. Good, so we do have side lunges today, so we're gonna make that one of our warm-up exercises here. Okay, four, three, two. Hold it on your right side, press it back. Little, little pulses if you'd like. Hold here for four, three, two, one, hold. Left arm up, stretch over. Turn to your right side. Left arm is out, bring the right arm to meet it. And then lift your torso up, drop down. Bring your arms with you. Tuck and roll. Hold it down right here. Hold, Incl in yeah, interlace your hands, reach it out. Round your back. No, Siri, I'm not talking to you. Pull your belly into your spine. And then come on back up. Straighten your back leg. Hands back on your thigh. Turn forward. Take it over to the other side. Nice and easy. Little pulses. You've got four more. Three, two, one. Take your right arm up. Stretch it up and over. Turn to your left side. Reach. Other arm reaches. Bend your knee. Reach your arms up overhead. Good, hold it there. Three, two, one. Hands down, round your back. Straighten your leg, hands back down. Turn it forward. Wide leg, round and curl your spine, little cat cows. Tuck your tailbone underneath you. Three, two, give me one more here. Round your spine. Press down, roll up, walk it in, heel toe it out. All right, so three sets, they're timed. Longest set is the first set. So we're gonna do a traditional squat. You, we've got three sets, so you can do three different positions of your feet or your hips. I'm gonna start in a neutral position and I'm gonna use a weight either in my hands, at my shoulders, over my head, or under my chin. So it's kind of up to you. All right, so again, First set is the longest, so maybe not your heaviest, but we should be doing okay. You had a good rest last night, yeah? All right, pick up your weights if you're using them. Set your feet about hips width apart, just a little bit wider than the hips maybe, and a little turnout. In three we start, two, one, here we go, squat. Weight back in the heels, chest up, go ahead. Good. I'm gonna run through all the legs and then we'll repeat it. So we'll stay with the same time for each um, exercise. So we've got 20 more seconds. Keep going for 15. If you wanna count the reps, that would be awesome. Last, just about 10 seconds. Let's do one more rep. Good, stand up. Second set. I'm gonna use one weight in between and we're gonna step to one side and then step to the other. Ready, set, three, two, one. I'm just gonna use a little rotation here. Come back in, side to side. Step out, come back in, step out. So get as big a step as you can. I'm getting about as far as I can with the space I've got. Good. 
So we've got this first set, 45 seconds with a 15 second rest. Keep going. Yeah, you've got 15 more seconds. Next exercise will be back to two weights if you're using them. Last five. Four, three, two, and one. Go to a heavy weight or one in each hand. You can use one, one heavy weight or two. It's a deadlift, traditional deadlift. Separate your feet hips width apart. Ready, set, let's go. Deadlift. Come all the way up. Stretch your hips back. Soft knees. Chest forward. Hips go back. Take your time on the way down. Good. Don't let your shoulders round. Good. There you go. Weight back to the heels. 15 more seconds. Keep it going. Good, don't round your shoulders, guys. Keep your shoulders pulled back so your collarbones point forward. Let's just get into one more. Stand up when you're done. Next exercise is an alternating lunge press. Then we're gonna go on the floor for bridges. Right leg back, we'll start with the right leg. Ready, three, two, go. So pulse, pulse, switch sides, pulse, Pulse, switch sides. Pulse, pulse, switch sides. Pulse, pulse, switch sides. Good. That's it. Keep going. Alternating, little pulses down. You know, if you're not lunging, you're doing that little step back or maybe just a calf raise. Woo. <laughs> that was me. Last 10 seconds, we've got one more exercise. We're gonna to head to the floor for bridges. In three, two, and one. Quickly get down to your floor. More than a bridge, we might make this a hip thrust. All right, so we're gonna put a weight on our belly or on our hips. Let's get ready. Three, two, one, we lift, good. So put the weight down on your hips if you can, and then thrust your hips into the air. Nice and big, nice and strong, squeeze your glutes. Dig your heels into the floor or the mat, wherever you are. Good, 25 more seconds. We're going to our second set after this. We'll be back to standing. We've got 10 more seconds. Big stretch, big articulation. Three, two, and one. Back up to standing. Next set, a little less time. So go ahead and feel free to grab some um, heavier weight. First set is our squats. I don't know why that weight is here. All right. So we're back up, two legs, two weights, one weight, your choice. 30 seconds coming up. Ready in three, two, let's go, squat. So I'm gonna do a little bit more turnout in this one, but not too wide. Weight back in the heels. Keep it going. Weight back to your heels, chest is up the entire time. 10 more seconds. We've got side to side coming up. Hang in there and rest, okay. Shorter rest, one weight or two you choose. Holding on, here we go. 30 seconds, three, two, step to the side. Good, here we go. Come back around. That's it.
side to side. Good, nice work guys. Hang in there, 10 seconds. Deadlifts will come next. Three, two, and one, pick it up. Deadlifts. I'm actually gonna keep the recovery the same. It's easier on my timer. It's easier on you. Deadlifts in three, two, here we go. All the way down, all the way up. Now, you can also add up on your toes if you'd like to. All the way up. Yeah, down, halfway there. Keep it going, you're still there in three, two, and one, good. All right, we're gonna have an alternating rear or front lunge with a pulse. You choose, get ready. Ready, three, two, alternate. One, two, pulse, switch sides. One, two, pulse, switch sides, you got this. Shoulders over hips, knee down, Tuck the tailbone underneath you. Good. Yeah. 10 seconds. Keep it going. Looking good. Three, two, and one. Back on the floor. All right. This is our last set of this, um, of this set. Put the weight on your hips. You can be on a ball. Three, two, let's go. 30 seconds. You don't have to go fast, just make it good, right? Almost there. Five more seconds. Three, two, and one. All right, less set, less time, less recovery. It'll be a total of 20 seconds. I'm gonna grab some water of work and 10 seconds of recovery. If this were a high intensity workout, we would be doing that the whole time. I'm gonna actually just change this. So you can see a little bit better. All right, everybody, pick up your weights. Three, two, one, squat. Good. Weight all the way back. Ten more seconds. Three, two. One, leave the weight down, or a weight down, or if you're working with two weights still, that's fine. Lunging side to side. We go in three, two, go. Step it out. So this set may be a little faster in movement, if you can maintain you know, good form. Because you're already 10 seconds in, 10 seconds out. Three, two, one, pick up your second weight back for deadlifts if you've got rid of it. Deadlifts into lunges next. Three, two, go. Down, up, maybe on your toes. Down, on your toes. Ten more seconds. We hit the lunges in five. And rest. All right, final set. Alternating leg lunges. We start in three, two, let's go. Lunge, lunge, switch. Good. Small movement, small pulse. Three seconds, let's finish on the left side. Two, and one, good, on the floor. Bridge, quick set of bridge, heavy weight on your hips. Let's go in three, two, one, go. 
Good. Squeeze your glutes. Good job. This is short. Short and maybe not so sweet. Five seconds. Three, two, and one. All right, gang. That's it for your um, lower body. Not really, but all right. Come back up to standing. We've got upper body now. So we're gonna be doing back rows. We'll go into biceps, upright rows. So get a couple of sets of weights if you'd like. And all of our weight work is standing. So we'll have shoulders as well. Get some light, rate, light weights if you need it. All right, same thing. 45 seconds is our first set. Let's get started. You had enough recovery time. Back rows, bent over rows, first set. We go in four, three, two, one, let's go. Bent over two arms, elbows by your side. Five, six for me. Head in line with spine. Keep going. If you're counting reps, this will be your most. And you got 20 more seconds. Ooh, yeah. Hang in there. This is your longest set. Five more seconds. Ooh, five. And put your weights down. Go to another set of weights for biceps or keep that weight that you've been using. All right, pick it up, get ready. Any bicep hammer, whatever you'd like. Ready, set, go. Curl. Good. If you need to, alternate arms. If you'd like to, you could do a hammer curl. You can do any bicep curl that really works for you because you have another 25 seconds of this. All right, so I'm just, I'm burying it. My arms must be tired from holding a baby. Good excuse, right? 10 seconds. Three, two, and one. Put it down. We'll do an upright row and I just, actually we'll do a rear delt and I just change what we're gonna do in my head. All right, rear delt, lighter waist perhaps. Bent over again, then we're going onto the floor. Ready, go. Fly, fly. So make sure you're not coming up with your back, right? Shoulder height or lower. Head in line with your spine. Abs are strong. Keep going, don't lift up your shoulder blades, no traps. Woo! All right, so much for the cool air. That went out the door. We're gonna go on the floor in about 15 seconds. Yeah. Hang in there, three, two, and one, come to the floor. Get your heavy weights for a chest press. Heavy weights, chest press. You can be in a bridge on the floor in tabletop. Arms up. Choose your placement. Three, two, one, let's go. Chest press. Good. That's it. Arms open and press up over your chest. If you're in a bridge, I'm in a bridge, make sure that your back is not starting to collapse. Good, 25 more seconds. Take your time, you don't have to rush through it just because it's timed. It's not, you know, it's not a Tabata set. Ten seconds. And put it down, 
Take a short rest. Maybe put your headband on. We've got chest flies. Same kind of weight if you can. Ready, on your back. Arms out, fly. Control, control. Make sure that you're going slower on the way down than perhaps on the way in. If you're in a bridge, again, don't let your hips collapse. Let your knees be over your hips and control. You can have your legs straight up, bent, or even bent on the floor as long as you can maintain a neutral pelvis. So belly is in, ribs are down. Good, 15 more seconds. This is our first set, longest set. So you know where we're going. Three, two, and one. Back up to standing, everybody. Come on up. Pick up your heaviest set of weights. Second set, bent over rows. In three, two, let's go. Just 30 seconds here. Good. Squeeze the shoulder blades, bring the collarbones forward. Looking good, guys, I see you all. Awesome job, 15 to go. Yeah. Five seconds, if you feel tension in your neck, just let your chin come down and rest. Good, bicep curls are next. I'm gonna go a little bit lighter with my biceps today. Any which way you'd like. We start in three, two, let's go. Curl, all the way up and down. Good. I just realized you guys at home can't see me on the floor. All right, keep going. Ten seconds. Three. Two, one, good, short rest. Rear delt, bent over flies. Pick up the weight you're using, bend your knees, go. Again, tension in your neck, drop your chin to your chest. Good, sit on your back, or get to your back, I should say. Don't sit on your backs. You choose what position you want your legs in. I'll go back into the bridge. Arms up, three, two, go. Chest press, good. Down and up. Good, stay nice and long. Fifteen seconds. Don't let your hips drop. If you're in a bridge, stay strong. Otherwise, a neutral pelvis. Three, two, and one. Release it. You can have your arms down like this just to sort of protect your shoulders. Otherwise, flies are coming up. I'm going to bring my legs into a tabletop position. Tilt my pelvis, arms up, ready, go, now. Open. Good. Pull the belly towards your spine, the ribs down towards your hips. Good job, everybody. extra or less seconds. Back up to standing. 
Final set. Less recovery time in between. Come on up. Pick up your weights. Back rows in three, two, go. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one. Good. Pick up your other weights if you're changing. Ready, go in three, two, curls, bicep. Good. And rest. Woo. All right, rear delts coming up. Three, two, go. Hang on, hang on. Hmm. Here we go, three. Two, and one. Back to the floor. Last two sets here. On your back for chest press. Hips up. Three, two, and let's take it a second. Let's go. Stay in your position. You can go up and down with your hips, actually. I mean, but I'd like to see a static hold if you can with control. Five seconds. And rest. All right, last set, flies. On your back, legs up, bent. On the floor, arms up. You choose, three, two, let's go. 20 seconds is all we got. Five more seconds. And rest. All right. Good job, guys. Um, I'm going to start on the floor. We're going to go back up, however, for some of our core work. So adjust your cameras a little bit. Maybe we can just, I can see you in both directions a little bit more. I'm going to grab some water because my mouth is really dry. All right. I don't know where my towel went either. Hmm. All right. First exercise. You don't need weights right now. So we're going to be on our back. One leg at a time. We're going to do a bent leg and a straight leg. So you can choose to keep your elbow behind your um, head or you can reach your elbow and then reach your arm. The other leg can be bent out in front or hover. You choose. All right, let's get started on this one. Right leg first, three, two, let's go. So we curl, bicycle, and do a straight leg. Curl. Now, if I'm gonna reach my hand to my foot, I'm gonna reach to the outside of that ankle. Knee in. Holding your leg up off the floor, the opposite leg will be more challenging and to your back as well. Good, 20 more seconds. One side only, right knee, right arm, straight leg. Good, a little hip hinging going on. A little bit into our obliques. I mean, excuse me, our hip flexors. Yes, our obliques, three, two, and one. Short rest, we go to the other side. Just the other side. So it'll be your left leg. Right leg bent or straight. You can start with a bent. Ready, go. Elbow in. I'm going to take my hand to the outside of the foot. Up. Now, I can bend my uh, straight leg, my right leg, or straighten it, or hover it. I'm not going to hover. Thank you, Siri. My exercise ring has closed. Twist. Stretch. Twist. Reach, twist, 15.
Five seconds. Three, and rest. Good. All right, next exercise is going to be a sprinter. Coming up, crossing elbow to opposite knee. If that doesn't work, you're on your back like this. All right? Three, two, one. Let's go. Up, cross. Up, cross. So this isn't for everyone, right? So here's another option again. We come up, maybe we're here. Twist, like that. Kind of similar to what we did, but on side to side. Keep going. 25 more seconds. Cross elbow to opposite side. Ten seconds. This will be your hardest set. Three, two, and one. Come on up to standing. We have two more exercises. One heavy weight, halo chops, alternating sides. Right? Pick up your weight. Three, two, let's go. Cross over, chop. Other way, chop. Keep it going. No diggity. Woo. Just cross the body. Work it, work it, work it, work it. Here we go. Last 10. Three, two, and one. No weights needed. Next exercise, wide plie, tick-tock side to side, or you can have your arms up overhead. I'll demonstrate a little both. Bend your knees, three, go. Side to side. Now, when you're side to side, the elbow goes behind the hip. Nothing moves except your torso. So I'm gonna do half and half. Good, I like to stop through the center, just kind of grazing my way through. And then, if you wanna try, arms overhead, just lean side to side. Bigger lever lengths might make it a little bit more challenging. Sit down lower. No diggity. That's it. Good, nice guys, 10 seconds. Oh, I just got one of those nice Florida breezes. Three, two, one, on your backs. Here we go again, right side. Knee and opposite ankle to foot. Right leg only. Three, two, here we go. Reach, reach. Outside the knee, outside the foot. Keep it going here, you bet. Uh, 15 more seconds. You got this. switch to the other side. Left leg is the mover. Right leg straight bent or hovering. Three, two, let's go. Hinge twist, up, reach. Really get to the outside of the leg. That's it, come on, you got this. Don't give in now, this is no time to stop. You're more than halfway through this workout. We're doing just fine. Three, two, and one, good. Two feet on the floor, sprinters, you choose. Maybe you stay on the floor and just do an opposite elbow to knee. Three, here we go. Three, two, come up. Remember, you can be here. 
If you don't do a full sit up, that's okay. Everybody's got to do what everybody's got to do. Three, two, and one. We're up on the floor. All right, one heavy weight, halo chops. Pick it up. Separate your legs. Three, two, go. Circle chop, other way. That's it. Halfway. two, and one. Put your weight down, separate your legs. Wide stance, hands behind the head and or overhead. Drop your seat, let it go. In three, two, go. Side to side. No movement in the lower body, just the torso. If you like this, stay with this. If you wanna change it up, arms up. Tick tock side to side. Last ten. Oh, I lied. Actually, three, two, and one. All right. Now, final set. Because we're standing, I'm going to keep us standing. Pick up your weight for your halos. Pick up your halo weight. Pick up your halos. All right, we'll start with halos, TikToks, then we'll move to the floor, and that's pretty much where we'll stay. So we'll adjust cameras if we need to. Get ready, bring the weight up. 20 seconds, side to side, halo chops. Three, two, go. Go. Up and around. Ten seconds. Three, two, and one. Put it down. Ready for your TikToks. Hips down. Three, two, go. Side to side. You can stay right with this, or you can take your arms up, side to side. Biceps by the ears, nothing else changes. Five seconds. Three, two, and one. Come down to the floor. Here we go. Right leg, bicycle, and straight. Ready, set, go. Bicycle, straight, or just say bent knee. Keep it going. 10 more seconds, you are almost there. Yeah, I know it's almost, but it's okay. Three. Two, and one. Switch to the other side. Left leg. We've got three, two, go. Twist, up, twist, up, go. Five seconds. Three, two, and rest. Sprinters, one leg at a time, sitting up. Three, two, go. Smile, it's almost done. Five seconds. rest. Woo, yeah. All right. We're going on our bellies. We're going on our bellies. So turn it over. You don't need any weights, I'm pretty sure. 
All right. All right, so now I'm going to change the time of this and do everything for 30 seconds. Don't be sad about that. I promise you, you'll be happy. First exercise, you're on your hands and knees. You're hovering your knees and stepping back and stepping forward without lifting your hips up in the air. Not a down dog, we have that, but not just yet. So it's a hovering tabletop or a bear. And we just step the legs one at a time back. See if you can alternate your front and back leg movements. All right? That's our first exercise. Then we go on our bellies for Superman. All right? Here we go. Let's see if I can do this without my clock. All right, tuck your toes. Hover your knees off. The hands don't move. Three, two, go. Out, out, in, in. Out, out, in, in. So see if you can think about changing the lead leg on the action each time you come into it. You're halfway there. There's no movement in your hips. I know it's challenging. Keep your knees as low, keep your hips low as well. You've got five, three, two, and one. Come down to your belly. All right, super person, super person. Arms out in front, if you have the space, I'm gonna have mine bent. Arms and legs lift together. Three, two, one, let's go. Up, up. Now, I'm looking up at you, do not look up at me. Keep your head long, line, uh, line up your head with the back. So no hyperextension. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Good. Push back. Quick stretch. Then we go back on our bellies. Arms are going to come out wide, wider than your mat. So you're on your floor perhaps. And all we're going to do are cobra push-ups, which means we're actually using our back, not our shoulders and chest as much. Ready in three, two, go. Right here, up and down. Up and down. Good. Lift your heart, stretch the front of your body. That's it. So it's a cobra push-up, meaning it's really a back extension exercise, more than a chest press or push-up. You just got five more seconds to do this. Three, two, and one. Push back to your heels. We've got a down dog to an up dog position. Hips are coming up, and then hips are coming low. Okay, three, two, let's go. Down dog, drop your hips, keep your legs strong, and lift your hips up. Those of you who are not doing it, you can drop your knees to the floor if you'd like to. Right, and just do a little bit of a upward cobra stretch when you get your knees to the floor. So it might look something like this, down, arch, and come back in. Three, two, one, on your knees, forearms down. Your favorite exercise, always a plank. Forearm plank. 30 seconds, guys. Remember when the days, when you did like three and a half minutes. Feet out, let's go. Hold it here. Now, if you have plank ADD and you want to touch the knee down or move side to side or hinge forward, that's okay. As long as your body stays really strong and centered. Pull the belly in, legs are strong. Head forward. Pull the belly up and in and in in. 10 more seconds. I could sit on you and nothing would change. Your back is that strong. Three, two, and one. Quick set of child's pose. All right, we're moving on. We're not there yet, but we have one more set. I do believe we have two more sets. So it's another five minutes of exercise for you. All right, come to a hovering tabletop, or come to tabletop. Tuck your toes underneath you, remember, Alternate your lead legs. Your back row, okay. Knees up, shoulders over wrists, three. You can also hold the plank, two, go. Step, 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 step. 
Step, 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 step. Without the hips moving up and down, right? We're not doing this. We're staying low and close. Good, keep a steady gaze. Don't hyperventilate, take your time, slow it down. Hold a plank or a hovering table if you need. Three, two, one. On your belly, Superman, super person that we are. Get ready. Push your pubic bone down, arms come up. Three, two, one, go. Head in line with your spine. Yeah. Good, nice strong lines behind you. Very important if you don't do a lot of this movement in your life and only do the forward movement like crunches, right? So if you're not getting yoga and Pilates in, we're gonna be throwing those in and more. Three, two, and one. Sit back, quick stretch. Just release your lower back. Come back to your belly. Cobra push-ups. Hands are outside your mat, underneath your elbows. Push your pubic bone down and lift. All the way up, down. All the way up, down. So again, it's not as much for my chest, shoulders, tries as it is for my back extension. 15 to go, that's seconds. Three, two, and one. Quick child's pose. We're back to the down dog, up dog situation. Hips up, downward facing dog. Three, two, let's go. Drop your hips, lift your heart. Keep going up and back. Up, up, up. Really allow for the extension of the spine. We've done and we do a lot of flexion all the time. It's much more natural for a lot of us. Three, two, one to your knees. Forearms down, forearms down. Elbows under shoulders. Tuck your toes underneath you, forearm plank. Step it out, three, two, let's go. Shoulders over elbows, belly lifted, knees lifted, crown of the head forward, nice and tight. Slow your breath down. Stay strong, stay strong, you've got this. Look forward, don't collapse into your shoulders halfway. Remember, if you have ADD, you can bring a knee to the floor without moving your hips. You can even take your hips side to side. I don't love that one particularly for this. Three, two, and let it go. Sit on your heels. All right, we're gonna finish this up really quickly. I'm gonna move you down to 20 seconds with no rest. We'll try it anyway, all right? Hands under shoulders, knees under hips. Hovering tabletop, no movement in the hips, right, just the legs. Lift up your knees, three, Two, go back, back, and in. After you're done with this, we're just gonna go right onto our bellies. Five seconds. On your belly, super person, super person. Right into it, that's it. You're gonna be done really quickly. A little bit more than a minute and a half. Good, cobra push-ups right here, up and down. Push your pubic bone down. We're into a down dog in about five seconds. Three. Two, push back, down dog, up dog. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got this. You still got this. Now you can make it a forearm plank or a plank on your hands. In three, two, and hold. Hold, stay nice and strong. Strong, 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 resist the earth, pull the belly in. Round your upper shoulders, knees lifted. Pelvic floor lifted. You've got five seconds from now. Three, two, one, and done. Oh my gosh. Reach your arms out in front of you. Stretch them all the way out. You did it, guys. You did it Monday morning. Mondays are hard. I don't like Mondays, as they say. If you're an 80s fan. Walk your hands to the right side. And walk your hands to the left side. Come back to the center. Let's take it on our backs. Hug your knees to your chest. Really tight, really tight. Lengthen your tailbone out. Cross the right leg all the way over the left leg, grab your ankles, shins, or toes. Drag your heels to your buttocks and lengthen your tailbone down. Open your arms. Shift your hips right, let your knees fall to the left. Good, uncross the legs, hug the knees to the chest. Cross left leg over right. Shift your hips left, let your knees fall to the right. Uncross your legs, hug your knees in. Feet to the ceiling, happy baby, which you just saw this morning, a happy baby. And then rock yourself up to sitting. Come around to your hands and knees. One more time. Tuck your toes under for your down dog. Walk feet and hands towards each other. Take your hands behind your back and place your fingers, palms together, knuckles away from you as you fold over. And then let your arms relax. Chin to chest, roll up. Take a big breath in, bring the arms up. Exhale, bring your hands together. Give yourselves a big hand. You are done Monday morning. Stay home safe, stay healthy. Get back, wear a mask.